This is Swift Plumber's customer number 12699-12699. Right here we're looking at, right past this outside wall, we've got uh, the main clean out. Right in here is where the bathtub uh, is going to go into the main line that we have a crack throughout this main line. Now in order to do this correctly, reinstating that may be remotely possible from a vent stack that's up on the roof over this way. We'll certainly try that. Also there doesn't seem to be a footing right there so we may be able to dig underneath this. We've given the customer two options to either line this pipe or replace it. Lining would obviously cause much less holes. This one, we always first try to re remote reinstate any Y, where a subline hooks into a main line. This one, the last case scenario, would be break from under the tub. We would try to remotely do it. If we didn't like how the remote did it, even if it worked, then we'd still want to replace it with a PVC Y. We also may attempt that from outside if remote and statement, reinstatement doesn't work. Last case scenario is to do anything with the tub. It would be preferable to even tunnel from each side and break right here from in front of the tub if necessary. This Y goes from the toilet and the lab sink also hooks into this Y. Now, on this Y, we can pull that water closet up and remotely reinstate that uh, with about a 95% chance of a good smooth remote reinstatement. But if we do have to break in front for that Y, we would probably replace both Ys right here when we do the liner. This line after this Y in the master bath shoots across the master bathroom and then you can see my tape mark on the floor where I clearly labeled it. Uh, now we're going to go in here and we are in what is the dining area and heading towards the kitchen and I am coming across here. This is where we've got a real nice clear uh, break. This line is clearly cracked throughout the line going all the way across this home. This line does head straight though, and it heads right over to here. This right here is where we have a Y from the kitchen. We would not remotely reinstate this because the liner that we use is a rigid and durable liner that would not go cleanly around this 45. We would propose to break these tiles out from here forward, going underneath the stove, over to this Y where the master bath we were previously in the guest bath. This is for the master bath. That right there is where the lab sink and the shower hook into. So we would break this out and actually put in a section of PVC right here because it would be better for the homeowner. Uh, this way would only break out approximately 10 tiles compared to the other way where we're going to, I think it's, it's in writing, it's probably 40 tiles. Uh, it, you're pretty much breaking across the whole house. So this would be the only section really uh, that we don't line that we want to fit together. The laundry was tested and was not seen entering this line at any point. Uh, so we're not uh, uh, doing anything with reinstatement on that line. I'm going to go into the bathroom and uh, this is our master bath and if you look my line is actually going from this toilet right and right on the other side of that wall is the stove. So you can clearly see how we plan to handle this we can do it one of two ways. We can line this pipe and save a majority of the breaking uh, and inform the customer to call insurance company uh, on this one. Uh, the insurance company might opt with a liner because if he does have extra tiles, uh, approximately 10 of them, uh, the insurance company wouldn't be covering uh, putting tile back or anything. Uh, depending on the insurance company, uh, he did have a sewer line that did come up, it did back up, and made a mess in his house with sewage all over. So normally uh, what I've seen in all these years of doing this, that the insurance company would cover the breaking out to get to the pipe, not the actual replacement, but breaking out to get into it, the damage done to the home, and the rough cementing of it. So that is the process that we would use to do this job and I will go outside to show you the main clean out here for this customer and let me walk right over this way this will be the, on the other side of that guest bath where I started the video this is where we've done our video inspection we've mapped out this line and 
right here is our video camera and that's where we've noticed our cracks from what we did was we jetted this line and descaled it uh, when we initially came here we did not see the the cracks or anything in here and We'll do this on a second video.